Hi, today I'm going to make clock here. A very very pretty flock. Very easy to make. Materials required are crepe paper in green and uh, peach color. This is uh, crayon, red color and a red colored pencil. These are some pips, orange color and this is a thin wire and green floral day. All the measurements are in centimeter. This is the stencil for the center. This is 4.5 by 4 centimeter. Cut one piece. This is a stencil for the petal. This is 6.5 by 5 centimeters and the stem is 1.5 by 1. Cut four pieces. This is of the sepal. This is 4.5 by 2 centimeters and the stem is 0.5 by one centimeter cut one piece and this is of the leaf this is 8.5 by 2.5 centimeters and the stem is 1.5 by 0.75 centimeters cut as many as you like cut a piece of thin wire about 18 centimeters long and take some cotton wool just a little bit not too much like this apply glue on top of the wire and put this wool on top and roll it to form a flatter shape like so take the white grey paper stretch it apply glue all over and stick this center on top of the ball like this just pull down the sides and then roll the ends. Cut a piece of the green floral tape, not very long. Stretch it. Now put some glue on one side of it, covering about half an inch or so. Now take these pips, you have to take four strands, fold it and then just stick it on the tape. Like this. Now take the center on the tape. First, just stick it in such a way that these stamen heads are just above the center. When you stick it, they will come all around. And then just take the tape up towards the top and stick it. So this is what they Take a petal and the red colored pencil. First just kind of draw an outline leaving the top area and the side area a teardrop shape. And then just color it in. and a bit of the stem also. Now take the red crayon and color the lower side of this shape, middle and lower side. like so. Now just place your thumbs in the center, lower half and stretch the petal. So it curves. Then take a pair of scissors 
angle the top outwards and then give crimps on top and on the sides so you get a petal like this so I've done all four. Now take one petal, apply glue on the stem, and stick this on the center, covering the green area. So it's going to come just above the green area. And take the next petal. stick it opposite to the first and at the same height And the next two petals will come on the sides and on the other side So it will form a cup like this. Now take the piece for the sepal, stretch it in the middle and the stem also. Apply glue. Stick this anywhere actually. So I'll stick it here. Like this. Now take a leaf and just score a line in the center to show the vein. I've already done with the other three. And you can attach as many leaves as you want. Now cut a piece of the green floral tape. Stretch it, start winding it from the base of the flower then just lower down or uh, slightly lower down and you can attach a leaf. attach a leaf so the leaves can be attached fairly close to each other not much of a gap given Now just curl the leaves a bit, so just hold the edge of the leaf, the base of the leaf and then curl them gently. Like this and then just open out the flower a bit if you want to. This is not very necessary. This is how the clock here would look.